Here. Boy. Hey, it's another treasure map. Looks like the Reavers made it inside. I hope they didn't take all the treasure. Expectations low, boy, and you will never be disappointed. you off guard. I wasn't expecting them. Exactly. Chests have been emptied. Probably by the Reavers. I hope they didn't take Sindri's whetstone. I told you about expectations, boy. Keep them low. I remember. Still, good feeling.
much for my good feeling. I was ready for them this time. I saw. So I should keep my expectations low, but always expect an attack? It is a delicate balance. Expect the worst, assume nothing, and always anticipate an attack. Sure is a lot to remember. shouldn't hope, but do you think we'll find it there? No. Back to piss on my corpse, you ungrateful little... Uh, who are you two? We're looking for a whetstone. Have you seen it? Aye, there was one in this room. My son sharpened his dagger on it, right before stabbing me in the back. What? Little bastard thought it was his turn to lead my crew. I was hard on him, sure. Hmm. Guess I shouldn't be surprised. I did the same thing to my dad when I was his age. He killed his own father? Where is he now? <laughs> he may be a bastard, but he's my bastard. You'll get no help from me, fool. Then his dagger will help. Hey! That's mine! Hey! Come, boy. We are leaving.
Why would his son betray him like that? Kill his own father? Over some treasure? Seems so greedy. Remember what I told you, boy. I see nothing. Well, sure. He didn't seem like a great father, but... You only know half the story. Yes. Be ready! You, uh, didn't happen to find that whetstone. We found no whetstone. This dagger belongs to the reaver who took it. They took most of the good stuff. Oh? Well, here, take this. In exchange for the dagger. The dagger you brought me is quite interesting. An artless design, but the construction is sound. Where in the temple did you find this? In a reaver's back. Oh. Maybe they took the Woodstone? Quite possibly. I know I've seen this design before. I have a favor to ask. Do you remember the dagger you gave me? The dagger stabbed him to the Reaver's back? His own son killed him? Yeah. I haven't forgotten that one. Well, I traced it to a group of Reavers that operate out of the Northree Stronghold. I'd wager that's where they took their haul from Fafnir's storeroom. Along with that Whetstone that I could use to help you? <sighs> Another treasure hunt? Pointless. Well, not if Sindri really can make us better equipment with that whetstone. Plus, the Reaver's son. He murdered his father. Atreus, to me! stories. When will you tell one that entertains? I beg your pardon? You just insulted you. Yeah, I got that. So you want a corker, do you? Very well, my brothers. I'll tell you the story of Brunia, the brawler. The real story. There was a huge battle, right? His shrine had him in the middle, fighting off Ace. Well, I can just tell you the story later. Freem. Are you okay? No, son. My goods are underwater. 
The men are drowned, and yet their bodies continue to walk the beaches. Hellwalkers. They plague these lands. I was their captain. They died because of me. But these abominations sully their memories. I will find a way to free them from their tortured state. In this, I am determined. The thunderstorm scattered all three of my ships across the lake. I know not what I did to anger Thor. Or his judgment was swift. Boy. Sir. Another map. Great. I wish mom were here. Wolver on your left, brother!
discovered opportunities for hunting and trade in these lands. I gave up my search for Jotunheim long ago. Leave that for the young. Boy, what a sad story. Yes. We should help him. Really? You are surprised. Well, yeah. I didn't think you'd care about helping a spirit. Fighting more Hellwalkers is good experience for you. Oh. story I started earlier. I was to tell you the story of Frunio the Brawler. The old story. A pretty story, but... No. Frunio, you see, was born with neither head nor heart. So the giants had to complete him with stone. He was strong, to be sure. But also a perfect simpleton. But I can just tell you the story later. difficult.
Getting a letter here and there. But we need the rest of the language disk. Story before. Was I? Oh yes! The real story of Hunyer the Brawler, a giant with head and heart of stone. Odin met him wandering in Midgard one day, found him so amusing, so harmless, so gullible, that he invites him back to his palace in Asgard. There he gives Hunyer his fill of mead, and goads him into all manner of boasts and antics, all for the amusement of the court. I saw the Aesir laugh as Hrunir leapt upon his shield and swore he'd kill us all and take our womenfolk back to Jotunheim. And we'll pick this up later. We're not getting in there without a key. We're in the middle of a story, were we? Odin had invited Hrungnir to his palace in Asgard, getting the simple giant drunk to amuse the court. Does he laugh? Oh no. Thor takes one look at the drunken stone buffoon and brings down Mjolnir on his head so hard that he's got chunks of Hrungnir in his own skull to this day. Thor is so startled by the face full of rock. He doesn't notice Hrunir's body topple right onto him with a sickening crunch. And again, the roars of laughter echo through the palace halls. That's an awful story, Mimir. Nothing like the one's mother told me. Might that be a lesson, my son? Truth is seldom so pretty as myth and legend. <laughs> 